So if you're a Shiba Inu holder or plan to invest into this coin in the future, then you really need to watch an entire video to understand what's going to happen to Shiba Inu here. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like this video because I make videos every single day talking about the latest and best altcoins in the crypto world. First things first, we have to go to CoinMarketCap and see what's been happening to this coin. As you can see, pretty much we are going down. The volume is slowly going up. But we are still decreasing. That means people are more selling than they are buying. The market cap, as I'm talking right now, is still going down. We're minus 37%. But is this it? Is this the end of Shiba Inu? No, this is just the beginning, guys. And I'm going to show you why. So basically, here we have almost, guys, look at this, almost 800,000 watch list. This coin is still not the number one most watched coin on coin market cap. So people are just watching this coin. People are just super interested into what is going to happen to Shiba Inu in the future because a lot of people do believe that this coin will be the new Dogecoin here. So if you do continue, of course, if you do want to buy this coin or sell this coin, you can of course buy it here on the market. So these are all of the exchanges you can find the coin here. So Hobby Finance, Binance, and so many other ways to buy it if you do want so. Now let's continue. If you go here to the chart, this is the most important part. So here is the chart, what is happening to this coin right now. As in soccer, now we still had another decrease on the coin. We did go down by 20% in the last two hours. So what is happening? Why is this happening to Shiba Inu? Did, did the developers something, do something that made this coin go down? The answer is no. Why? Because if we go to basically even Dogecoin here, you can just see that we are going down. Like every single coin here is just going down. So many coins are continuing slowly here to go down. Actually, look at this, guys. So basically, even Dogecoin here, they go down by 20, 20% 20 in the last four hours. So massive amounts of decrease for every single coin here. The whole market is going down. So is this, like I said, Shiba Inu's fault? No. Like you have to remember, guys, this is not Shiba Inu's fault. This is nothing about the developers. This is nothing that what they did do. This is all about the market right now. People are panic selling like crazy. So people are just super afraid. So what happened here? Why are people panic selling? There's a combination of so many different things that did happen. But one is, of course, the Elon Musk thing where he did, did talk about Bitcoin. The Bitcoin like mining is not that good. And that started a catalyst. So because of what he was talking about, like people thought that Tesla did sell their Bitcoin, but Tesla didn't sell, sell their Bitcoin. Basically, Elon Musk did troll a lot of people and because that the value of the coin did drop by a lot. Now, we're still continuing to drop. Why are we still continuing to drop? Basically, it looks like China has some more restrictions on crypto than before. This is the latest news. And it looks like now, because of those news, we're seeing massive amounts of decrease for all the coins. So, people are just selling Bitcoin. You can just see how much we're going down. You can just see this red wick here is basically going down more and more. Now, what's going to happen to Bitcoin here? We have one more, like one last chance for Bitcoin to be saved. And then we're going to have basically uh, continuing the bull run. You have to remember that we're still in this giant bull run. We're still continuing to be in the giant bull run. But the end of the bull run may be pretty soon. Or maybe we're just going to delay it delay it for later by the end of the year. It all depends what's going to happen in the next few days. Now, what I really think that happening here is that this is basically a coordinated attack. Like this is a coordinated attack by the news and everybody, and everybody to make all the coins go down. So why would they do this? Why would they make all the coins go down? My theory is because basically here we hit these levels so many times. Like so too many times we hit all of these levels here. And that's the biggest problem here. We hit so all of these levels so many times that basically the biggest investors thought, okay, it's time to make the decrease Bitcoin. We're gonna buy at the dip probably. And then later on, we're going to increase and double or triple our huge money. So what I predict is going to happen that we are going to hit all the way to this level for Bitcoin. It's going to be about 30K here, $30,000. So for Shiba Inu, the exact same thing. We're still going to continue to go, go down. We're going to find some stability in this area. So 0.0008 is going to be an area that's going to be really helpful for us. Now, the biggest problem, if my prediction is right, that Bitcoin is going to go to that level, then that means Shiba Inu will drop even more. So I have to be serious with you guys, I have to be real. Basically, if we do continue to go down like this, Shiba Inu will go down by 50% more. So that will, that's going to be from the all time high, all the way to here, 86%. So a lot of money will be lost, of course, but stabilization is key here. So this is what we need. Either we're gonna stop at this area and then stabilize, or we're gonna go down even more to this area and then stabilize. 
but the whole point is a lot of money a lot of people are just selling right now so huge things are happening to the whole market you can just see so much so much traded signs but what do i think do i think that this is the end of the bull run no i don't think this is the end of the bull run i think that we're, what's going to happen is that we're going to see some stabilization so we're going to hit that level for bitcoin i hope i hope the bitcoin will not get past this level the end of the bull run would be if Bitcoin passes this 29,000 or like 30,000 level. If it does pass this level, like that level, that would be a huge problem. So 30,000 basically is going to be the level. It's 30,000 or 29,000 basically. But somewhere around there, that is the level that we need to be afraid of. If Bitcoin goes underneath that level, then we're going to see mass amounts of decrease. But if we just stay there, What's gonna happen? We're gonna see ma major stabilization. So major stabilization for all of the coins here. The stabilizing, stabilizing, stabilizing. So it's going to stabilize. Now, why is this important? Why we need stabilization? It's because if Bitcoin stabilizes, then we're gonna go into the altcoin season. So altcoin season pretty soon here. This is not a draw for leash, but I think it's the exact same pattern is going to happen to Shiba Inu here, where we are going to go down. This is I'm going to show you guys this is my, based on my prediction. We are going to go down probably either to this level or we're going to stay in this level. What I think most likely is if Bitcoin continues to go down that we are going to stay in this level here and then stabilize a lot of stabilization here. So stabilization, then what's going to happen? We're going to get some new news. We have the stabilization. We're going to have Shiba swap. So Shiba swap releasing boom, mass amount of increase for the coin. There you go. So people who bought in this area here are gonna have a lot of profit. Why? Because if we ever go back to this level here, and we will, it's gonna be six six hundred percent increase. So people who didn't have a chance before to get a lot of profit, now will be able to buy the coins for a lot cheaper. It's basically a huge discount. It's a huge discount for the coins. So a lot of positive things can happen here. Like I said, so stabilization. Now people people will have a lot of money because a lot of people did sell here. Now what's gonna happen is. Because they did sell, they can invest into different coins. Because Bitcoin was a huge coin, now they have a lot of money to invest into other coins that are not Bitcoin as of yet. So Bitcoin is going to stabilize, but the rest of the coins, the whole altcoin like theme, the whole, the, every single altcoin will try to slowly go up. Of course, only the good ones will keep going up. And because Shiba Inu here has a huge community that love the coin, basically, everything's going to be okay. And they have to remember, probably... People who are selling right now, these are the people who are not in the Shibinu community as really strong holders. These people probably are some whales, not really whales, but people who are real investors, like we real whales, people who have, who have only thinking about making profit in like the next one day or two days. But Shibinu holders are somebody who's going to take for the long run. It's going to go for the long run to make huge amounts of profit. So there you go. Like I said, as in talking, we're still seeing a lot of decrease because it's pretty terrifying. You can see 40% decrease. I'm not gonna lie. The whole market is basically going down. Bitcoin still, as I'm talking, going back to this level, continuing to go down. And as you can see, every single time it happens, it just breaks so many levels. It does just continue to go down. Like I said, I'm gonna we're gonna see probably if we do hit this level, another, I think it's 15. Yeah, 15, 16, even maybe 18% decrease until we reach this level. That should mean again, Shiba Inu will hit. All the way to this level also stabilize shiba swap releases boom all the way to here so massive increase stabilization then again we got some new news something like robin hood listing this coin here shiba inu then again boom massive pump all the way to here this is what i predict will happen to this coin it's not pretty soon but the next like 30 days what i feel like is going to happen because it's a really bad idea for shiba inu to release the shiba swap now if the whole coin is going down so it's it's, it's gonna be still pretty stupid for them to do it. So I don't believe they will do it right now I believe they will do it when it stabilizes when they see stabilization and then to pump the coin to make the coin increase They're going to release it boom making the coin jump by a lot of here At least it's going to double like a hundred percent increase I think if everything goes okay if Shiba Swap is okay and the people do enjoy Shiba Swap only then only then will this coin be able to continue to go up slowly here. So like I said, so many things need to happen to this coin if we want them to continue to go up. But I still feel like, like I said, we this is not the end of the bearish of the bullish market. We are still pretty much bullish. You can see somebody, some people just bought the dip here. A lot of people here, a lot of smart traders, a lot of smart traders right now are buying all of the dips here. So we're gonna see what's gonna happen to all these coins. For now, still huge, huge amounts of decrease. Every single coin, like every single, you can just see out of here spiking 
losing how much is this from here to here already 30 percent in just a couple of hours here that's insane guys this is super insane yeah it's like in 12 hours in 12 hours 30 percent 35 percent there you go so much decrease for all of the coins here but like i said we have to hit a level a certain level of stabilization of support and that support should be right over here in this area for this coin but like i said we have to wait it out and see what's going to happen hopefully we do stop there and then stabilize i don't think we can go any more down but huge amount of stabilization will happen to all of these coins and then slowly guys slowly new updates new releases new good things are going to happen and what i feel like will happen to bitcoin is that tesla or some like huge companies or just uh, type in something like we're gonna get some new news from them saying that they're going to buy the diff for bitcoin stuff like that so good things will happen i feel like good things will happen i don't feel like we're in a crash right now because there's too many people inside of this bitcoin to crash we have to go basically to like 10k so it's not a good idea for people to sell underneath 30k like it's not it's just not a good idea and if you didn't know basically only the people who are selling right now or the people who bought bitcoin pretty soon like in the last like three months something like that uh, the the long the biggest the biggest whales here are not selling they're buying so bitcoin whales you have to remember bitcoin whales right now are not selling they're buying but the people the people who invested like 1k 2k 5k they are selling like those people are selling because they don't want to have a loss of course but they do not know that later on it should be able to continue to go well like this is my this is just my opinion guys if you i'm not a financial advisor if you do want to buy these coins you have to do your own due diligence and your own research of course so this like i said this is what i feel will happen slowly stabilization going up and then really good things can happen to all the coins to not just these coins but shiba inu especially because shiba inu has such a huge huge community strong community people are just holding you can just see if you go here to the reddit people are just holding this coin because let's say guys be patient guys be patient don't give up on ship hold your coins if not add some more to your collection while you can ship has potential and i will and it will and i will blow up and it will blow up i have lost more than 2k but i'm still holding put your phones away for a little bit everything will be all right because this i'm rick rolling this thing and never gonna give you up never gonna let you down there you go i am from a high of 20k and now low 8.5k frustrating but holding patience is virtue brother have faith there you go because you have to remember guys this isn't because of shiba inu this is because of the whole market because bitcoin because the fud that's been going down about crypto this couple of days ago and because of that mass amounts of decrease this is not the developer's fault this is just how crypto works and what is happening to the whole market people are just afraid it's pretty normal to see you cannot not be afraid of what's happening here if you just wake up look at your phone and see coins going down by 40 percent 30 percent 20 percent of course, you're gonna be afraid to even sell the coins here. So there you go. There's so many things that can happen, but this is my theory: what will happen to all these coins. So in the future, I feel like this coin will be able to hit again our all-time high. It's not pretty soon, like I said, month or two for us to hit that level. But like I said, a lot of people can buy this dip here. A lot of people can be able to buy this dip that didn't have the chance before. And then look at this. Look at this increase. Such a lot of month. It's a lot of amount of increase. Super cool to see here. But hopefully it does happen and hopefully we do reach, I feel like in the future like of this coin, we will be able to reach a 0.01 cent area. And if that happens, it's going to be amazing for this coin here. So guys, if you did enjoy this video, it means so much to me. If you can like this video, comment down below and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching and see you guys in the next video.